failure was never a fucking option. We never, it never crossed what if. We were just doing it. There was no option but to make it work. Where the fuck are you going and where the fuck have you been? You're all so busy talking about all the shit you did, but you're not talking about what you're doing because you're not doing anything worthy of talking about. Everything you did was 10, 15, 20 years ago. That's done. You did that shit. Now what, you're done? You just sit and watch fucking television? That's what we have to talk about is television and TV and the news and some shit that we're not directly involved in? What are you doing worthy of talking about? Do you remember when you would tell those fucking stories and try to entertain those chicks and try to impress them to get that fucking pussy that you weren't going to keep and once you had it you didn't want it you remember that shit you would tell those stories what if those were real stories what if you didn't have to tell fucking lies everybody's trying to one up each other with some shit that's not real what if your shit was real what if you fucking did enough stuff to create enough real stories that that is fucking impressive enough and enough that you don't have to lie what if your lies were truths what if the story's out there? I want people, I want to continue to do shit. I want to do more and more and more. And I don't want me talking about what I did. I want to hear other people talking about what I did. But even better, I love when a dude is telling a story that's my fucking story. He wasn't there. He wasn't involved in it. The story has been told so many fucking times. And so many people were impressed by some shit that we just did. We didn't do it thinking it was impressive. Looking back on it, we wonder nowadays why other people can't do that, why they're not willing to do it. Because it wasn't anything impressive. We did it out of necessity. Failure was never a fucking option. We never, it never crossed what if. We were just doing it. There was no option but to make it work. Starting business. We were at Target cutting buckles off of fucking grocery carts. Why didn't we go to Walmart? Because we didn't have a Walmart. It didn't exist in San Diego. It was Target. We were stealing buckles from Target shopping carts. We were cutting canvas off military trucks at old depots and old National Guard units that, where they might show up every two months. We were stealing straps off of seat belts and out of trucks and cars. We did what we had to do to build the stuff to get the samples because we couldn't afford the webbing. We were driving two, three hours taking credit cards that we had just gotten trying to buy gear and then we got there and they don't take credit cards. We didn't have a choice but to make it fucking work. Meanwhile, everybody nowadays is talking about some bullshit on the fucking internet that they didn't actually do because they don't have any of their own stories. We see dudes telling our stories as though they were theirs and they don't even know the truths of what has happened and what the stories has evolved into some crazy shit. This should be a movie. Where the fuck are you going? And what the fuck are you doing? Do something worthy of bragging about and then stay so fucking busy you don't have time to brag. Let other people do your bragging. Evaluate. Is that what you're doing or is that not what you're doing? And if you're watching my videos, why are you not doing that? Stay busy. Do real shit. Move forward every day. One more step today than yesterday and one more step than tomorrow. It accumulates. It compounds. It all adds up. You just have to fucking do the work. Stop watching people do it and you go do it so that you have something worthy of people watching.